Hello ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, I'm Cody X2006 and today I'm bringing you a toy review of the R.I.D. Robots in Disguise Optimus Prime 2007? I can't remember, all I know it's the older generation. To let you guys know on this toy and on a couple of toys, I've been purchasing said toys at garage sales. Can't find them anymore, but find them on uh, Amazon and uh, eBay. But they're a hefty ticket. I found this and the other transformer that goes with this at a garage sale. Pretty much complete except the tires. They just happen to fall off. Happens to a lot of great toys. So, let's go ahead and get a look at uh, Optimus. So what we got here is a Japanese, I do believe it's Japanese, fire truck. As you can see, he has, you know, go ahead and get a good view of the side here, guys. The paint on this is very, very nice. Yeah, there's a combiner warhead. Or super mode head, sorry. got this uh, right here he has a uh, ladder as you can see even without the wheels this thing still rolls pretty good all right go ahead and get a frontal shot of this here for you guys nice big windows there there you go. So, like I said, it's your basic fire truck right here, though, on the good old thing. This arm does do 365 degrees. What's really cool, though, is you go ahead and lift that up. Go ahead and point the camera at that, guys. And you press this here red button. You get dual cannons. Um, sorry for the noise in the background, guys. It's really warm here in the great state of Oregon. Just had a thunderstorm a couple hours ago. But, uh, you get dual, I guess, fire extinguishers. Also, <clears throat> you come back here. Yeah, glory come right back here you guys see that little button right there okay go ahead and zoom out for you guys real quick we press that button and we get four individually firing missiles show you guys they work all right how do you fire this one Okay, I don't remember how to fire the missiles on these ones for some reason. It's been a while since I've uh, just touched, messed around with this toy, yeah, sorry. All right, we'll go ahead and fold these back down. Go ahead and fold this back up. Okay, guys. So, for the transformation, you're going to come right here. You're going to go ahead and put this guy in robot hut. You're going to come right here. You're going to pop that tap. You're going to come right here on the thing. <clears throat> well, actually, you're going to bring that tab all the way around. You go ahead and fold it in like that. All right. Same thing on the other side, guys. You go ahead and fold that. Now, come right here. And you're going to pull. Wow, it's on there tight. You 
you're going to go ahead and pop the tabs here. And same thing over here. Alright, go ahead and set that over to the side for now. Go ahead and pull this off. Go ahead and put it on the other side. Ah, something I didn't show you guys. This is Optimus' gun. Nothing really special about it. Get a little spinning wheel up here. Uh, when he's in vehicle mode, it will store right here. You guys can see there's two slide grips, one here and one right here. You gotta line those up. Tada, that's the weapon storage mode. All right, so we'll go ahead and set this set for now. What you're gonna do is you're gonna come right here and pull this part. You're gonna separate the back from the cab. Go ahead and bend this up. Take the feet, unlock them. You come right here, open this white panel. Bring out the feet. Snap that white piece on the right. And then what you do is you come back here. <clears throat> Oops. You spin the leg like that. Same thing on the other side. Go ahead and pop that. Pull the foot out like so. Pop the white piece back in. We have officially created Optimus's feet. Getting kind of tall here, guys. So, ooh. <clears throat> what we're going to do here, come right here, you're going to separate the arms, you're going to pull down and twist to get the reveal for the hands, alright big guy, same thing here guys, you're going to do the same thing. And then you're going to take this, you're going to press it down, ooh. And for the epic head reveal. All right, go ahead and get them rebalanced here. Make sure you're white pieces in there. Huh. Alright. Go ahead and take the two. There you go. He's got two little uh, oh, lights for the fire truck to go up here. You can just angle them like you did in the TV show. The joints on this guy are, at least in my copy, like I said, I bought it used. The kid was really happy to get rid of it because he didn't like Transformers. It's okay, he'll learn one day. So, let's go ahead and get a uh, epic headshot there. Oh, come on camera, focus for me. Oh. Zoom back out here for you guys get a nice clean there we go good get out some more guys there we go all right got some nice working here on the headpiece the head is on a swivel joint or a ball joint I don't know never took it apart but he does do full 360, his little things on the side move, come back out, he does have a full 360 on the arm rotation. 
he can bring his arm out. Well, if you twist it, he can bring his arm out to do the I'm pumping iron pose. But due to this piece right here, it gets in the way of coming straight out. Nothing down here. You get a bicep, like I said. You get hip rotation. You get leg rotation. You can also bring out the leg about that far sideways. Due to the transformation, if you pop this red piece up, you can get him to go back. It looks like pretty far there. And down here, you do have a twist here. And we do the transformation and tilt there. <clears throat> so there's Optimus. Now you're asking, well, what about his trailer? Well, guys. All right, is he going to stay? You going to stay? All right, stay. Thank you. Well, guys, let's go ahead and bring his trailer in. So we're going to take Optimus. We're going to move to the side. All right, the trailer. So you guys seen it. So what we want to do is come up. Then Alright, sorry about that guys. Okay, so what you want to do is bring the ladder all the way up. Go ahead and take this piece, and it's on a hinge. You bring it all the way forward. Go ahead and hit the button up top. Get yourself a little cannon. Alright guys. I'll bring that out. He's getting kind of tall, isn't he guys? Go ahead and focus back down here. So we go ahead and take. Go ahead and take them off. This. Go ahead and set it down like so. News there's something wrong. Sorry, guys. Oh. Okay, we're going to lay that down for now. Come back here, and you want to pull this and that. Go ahead and separate. So you got some rocket lunches. Kind of cool. Get a close-up on that for you guys. The detailing in this toy is really, really cool. Again, sucks the rubber's on, but... Hey, for 10 bucks, I'm not going to complain. Especially when 90% of the toy, 95% really, there was nothing wrong with it. Okay. Go ahead and set. So there's pegs right here. Go ahead and just. Okay, you want to get there. And, oh, maybe not. Hold on, guys. It's been a while since I've done this. Sorry, guys. So you want to unfold the hands. You want to aim the hands forward, like so. Right? Sorry about that guys, I had to go check something here because something wasn't making sense. 
now it does. So what we do is we take this piece, we go fold it out, we go and lock, oh. right? Again, we do the same thing right here. We go ahead and fold this out, go about there, go and fold the feet in, we go ahead and lock them in place. Then we take this and we put it back together. Guess. Then we take the top and you would put it back in its regular formation there. I really messed up, guys, yeah, sorry. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take that, like yeah, sorry guys. You're gonna take that and just there you go. Now you go ahead and set this to the side. Okay, so what you want to do with these is you want to spin it around like so. Bring hands out. There you go. You want that configuration, guys. Make sure this blue piece is pointed out to you. And then what you want to do is... You want to grab, you want to grab this one, wait, yeah, you want to grab this one, you see there's a little hole there, and if you come over here, you have that peg right there, now we're going to line them up, now you have one, that doesn't look right, it does not. Sorry about that, you want to grab that peg, you want to go ahead and stick it right there. Whoops. So you basically want it looking like this. Okay. You go ahead and set that to the side. Now you want to do the same thing over here, I guess I guess. Go ahead and just pull this out. Make sure you see that. Get that and that. There you guys go. So there's those two pieces, right? And you just bring in this piece. And now you have a make shift battle station. Pretty cool if you ask me. Alright guys, you're asking what else does this trailer do? Well, it is something really, really cool. So we go ahead and grab these pieces and set them to the side for now. Go ahead and grab this and we pull it off. Okay, go ahead and separate this. Come here, you lift that panel up, you lift this up. And now you have a boot. Do the same thing on the other side, guys. So you want to come right here, grab that out, and now you have a boot.
go ahead and bring Optimus in guys and what you're wanting to do is the bottom of the foot he's got that big hole and we got that pin right there so you go ahead and stick his foot in there Oh, wrong way. Sorry, guys. Get some pressure there. Go and lock it up there. Same thing on the other side. Next part, go and lower his arms, take the shoulders, bring them out, good, there you guys go. So we're going to come over here now and we're going to grab this piece, good, zoom out on here, we're going to grab this piece. What you're wanting to do is, you're gonna have where they at? These two holes right here go right here, right here on the farm. So what you want to do is line those up. Go ahead and snap them into place. Then pull it over here down and now we have Optimus's super hand all right do the same thing on the other side guys again remember just oh go ahead and spin the gun forward not big Go ahead and straighten the shoulders out. Alright guys, so the next part, go ahead and set him aside for a second, is this piece. So what you want to do is go ahead and, oops, not pop the sides off, go ahead and fold all these down. So what you want to do, you want to take it right here, you're going to bend it sideways and then ro rotate this piece so it's over his left shoulder and then you're going to do this. So now the piece is folded over the back. Alright guys. So what you want to do now bring this in go ahead and grab it right here and you pop it up go ahead and take go ahead and get the wings down there get the arms straight back out so what you're doing is, if you guys can see, there's two pegs here on his shoulder, and there's two matching holes underneath right here. You guys see them? You're going to line those up, like so. You're going to bring the chest piece down, let it click into place. Yeah, 
he's a heavy one, guys. up here. Oh, sorry guys, we're having minor difficulties here. Okay, so on my wow, so on my character, for some reason, I need to figure out how to get these joints in there better, but I've never had this much trouble. Come on, guy. Gonna put his arms down, get him straight. All right, let's try this again, guys. Sorry, I don't know what's going on tonight. Okay, we're having way too much complications tonight. Hold on, guys.